Ah, it's over there. I see it. Go and get it. Be quick and quiet. I do not want to get noticed. Okay. Well, be careful. Be dressed. Waiting for nobody. Yes. Yes. Got it right here. Yes, I can see that. Now, we have to take this back. Like I said, waiting for new life to come. We just need that brain. Now, let's take it and let's go find that brain first before we take it back. Of course. Ah, look, it's still there, hanging. Go and get it. Okay. But this brain is useless. It's not the right one I want. Uh, I'll get another one now. Uh, yes, of course. Thank you, gentlemen. <laughs> Lol. Look at him. Look how ugly is he is, the purple one. <laughs> He's so fat. His eyes so big. <laughs> okay then, never mind. Hey, shut up. I'm trying to finish. And to conclude, ladies and gentlemen, here we have one of the most perfect specimens of the human brain that has ever come to my attention of the university. Here is a normal brain from a criminal. Except it's not abnormal. What, does the brain have abs? No, no, of course not. That's not possible, you stupid. Now listen up. Pay attention. There's scarcity of the convolution on the front lobe of the brain compared to the normal brain, which doesn't. And the distinct deterioration of that of the front lobe. All of this stuff in the brain concludes and fits the puzzle together of that that man was evil and intentions of all his murder and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm so smart. You are now dismissed. Mm. Huh? The window. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here it is. Huh. What was that? Oh. Damn it. I dropped the brain. I grab this one. I think he'll be okay with this. I'm getting out of here if anyone notices. Oh. <coughs> Victor! Yes? Listen, it's Luigi, not Victor. Gosh. Just my bow tie. There we go. I'm getting worried. I know. Where is he? I don't know. The last time I saw him was two months ago, outside a graveyard, when I was just leaving. I saw him and his assistant going there. I asked him why he was going to the graveyard. He said it was just for his work and he needed some parts. And I asked, why, what is it? And he said, shut up and it's none of your business. And he said, I wouldn't understand. And then I left. And I've never seen him ever since. Oh, yeah. Well, he shouldn't be wasting all his time on his experiment, even though it's important to him. I just want to see him. I want this wedding. I know, I know. Listen, listen. It will come in due time, don't worry. We're trying to do the best we can to find him. But we just haven't heard of him in a while. I could go to his 
medical school, he learned all of his wicked and mysterious science. Yeah, that's probably what I'll do. Great! I'm going to! But you can't. I don't care! Fine, come on. Yeah, why did he leave? Oh, Frank and Wild was a brilliant young lad. But also really troublesome and annoying sometimes. He would always be late for class, like 10 minutes late. But that's besides the point. What I do know is that, well, you know his electric calculus and our biology. We have our certain theories here at the university we contain, and his were just over the limit for us. He was too smart, and what's it called? When he wanted to do his experiments, the bodies we offered him for it, he didn't like. They were not the right, perfect enough bodies for his experiments. He needed other ones. Oh, <laughs> what's the a few rabbits and dogs and guinea pigs or something like that? What what harm is that going to do? <laughs> I don't think you'll quite get it, do you? He's more advanced and smarter than you actually think. It's more than that, not just any stupid old dogs or things. Human ones! More advanced human ones. Ones that for our prop and tell for our classes. He wanted specific ones. They have to be right. He, uh, he keep asking us about the bodies and it was out of our league to tell him. So. I've never seen him ever since then, and he's gone for a couple years now. Please come. I don't know, and I really want to see him, honestly. He was kind of annoying. Ah, oh, please. Come on, we're having a lot of trouble here. There's a big plan, a wedding coming up, and we, he must see, she must see him in time, and stuff like that. Come on. <sighs> Fine. I'll go. I guess I could see my old pupil and see how he's doing. Very well. I'll come. Yes! Okay! Let's go! Yeah. Engine, stop messing with the, with him. Oh, yes. I was just looking. It looks freaky in his hand. It might come alive at any second. It can't come alive just yet. It hasn't got any... The electricity hasn't hit him. And the power source is the electricity. I checked. And it should be about 15 minutes until the storm comes. And it should be powered up. Oh, yes. I think we might not have enough power, though. What do you mean? So, I, 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 got, I got this. Because I don't think the electricity is going to do all that good. Oh, I dropped it. Okay. Here we go. What is that? It's a... It's a crystal. Or a, a gem or something. Yeah. I know it's pretty powerful. If we put this in next electricity, it might power him a bit more and give him more strength. Or something like that, I guess. Um, okay. I'll try that. Now. Hmm, we just got to wait for the storm to come. Got to wait for it. Oh. Really? At this time? Agent, go and see who it is. Yes, of course. Oh. Hello? Go away. You can't see him. Leave. Oh, oh, what is it? There's, there's a couple of people out there. What do you mean? Three different people. An old man and another man and, and a woman. They say they want to see you. Uh, I'm very busy. I tell them to go away. But they won't listen. They keep knocking. Huh? All times I'm going to go tell them. You got to be kidding me.
Uh, open up. Wait, who is it? It's me. Daisy's here as well. Oh, Luigi! Uh, tell her to go away, and you as well. I'm really busy. She really wants to, come on. Uh, God damn it. I'm quite all right, Daisy. Look, I know it's important. I believe in you, but I can't leave you this night. Please. Ah, oh, come on. I don't want no offense, but I don't want you to ruin it. It's the perfect night. Can't you please stay off just for one night? No, she can't. Ah, uh, what? You're a cr you're crazy. Oh yeah. Well. I wish he was crazy. I created life up there. I'm going to create it. I got all my perfect specimens agrees. This lightning will help me. Oh, great, you brought this old fart. Yeah, shut up. I just want to see my pupil on there. Pretty much made me to kill me with him. I see you. Well, it's nice to see you too. Jeez. Yeah, I see this stupid. Theory is probably gonna be wrong and it's not gonna work. I I am the smarter one. Eh, very well. If you think you are, come and you'll see who's wrong goes right. Ah, eh. oh, hey, tell me, got to adjust my bow tie. <clears throat> there we Please. go. Sit down here on the floor. Yes. Okay. You too. Please. Hey, you sit down as well. Okay, well, I don't want to take crap from anymore. Yeah. I'm going to look over it. No, don't. I want to see that thing over there. It's. Le leave it alone and sit down with the rest. Fine, I, ins I, ins I insist. Now, you said I was crazy. Ah, uh, you will see. We'll see about that tonight. And you thought that I wasn't good enough. I never said that. Well, anyways, you taught me a lot at your university. But now, I'm going to show you that I was right about the bodies, I needed the ones, and I will show you that I can create life. Now stand back and admire, and don't come over that side. Stay there. Please. Thanks. I just wanna have a look. No! I got my eye on you. Don't move. Like he said, stay there. Now. Uh -oh. Okay, stupid crap. <sighs> so stay there when I do this. Okay, engine, lift it up. Okay, it's a random stick that just came out of nowhere. Yeah, the lever has been activated. Oh yes, it's about to happen. Come on, work, come on. Maybe hopefully this game will help. Let's see. He's, he's moving. Get it off. Get, get the quote off. No way. You gotta be kidding me. It's alive! It's alive! It's alive! It's alive!